So let's talk about website, eShop, blog, and Pinterest and why you should definitely verify your website or any kind of platform with your domain like blog or eShop with Pinterest and why it's so important. Hello again, I'm Michaela. I'm Pinterest manager and strategist and I'm here to show you and help you to monetize from Pinterest. So let's go back to the video. Why you should have website and to be successful on Pinterest? Yes, maybe that's a question you are asking yourself because maybe you are selling on Etsy or different kind of platforms or maybe you will sell on Marketplace or different platforms which are not your domain. So what does it mean? Really, Pinterest wants you to verify your website, blog or e-shop, uh, any kind of platform which is yours with Pinterest. Why? Because you are basically telling Pinterest, this is my domain, I bought it, it's mine, and I can promote my brand or my products on Pinterest because all the content, it's mine. Yeah, all the blog posts, if I have all the products or any kind of um, website, really, or any services, maybe you're selling courses, you are a coach or one-to-one uh, -one meetings or coaching programs, things like that. Anything what you're really selling is basically you have your own website, you bought a domain and it's not a third party domain. Like, as I said, like example, it's for example, Etsy, because you don't own Etsy, right? You cannot put any code, you cannot put any changes in there. So you really want your domain. And it's, what does it mean? What is domain? Domain is maybe, uh, for example, my uh, website is pininspiration.com or any kind of uh, issue platform I show you before, which is, for example, in my case, uh, funfood, funfoodtravelgear.com. That's my shop, e com store, right? I have my platform on Shopify and you see this is uh, verified with Pinterest. Do you see like this, uh, this let's say like a globus and you see this website has been claimed. Why also it's important? First, when you click on any pin, I'm going to show you like an example, okay? So you see my pins. Let's go to my e-com store profile, business profile, and let's see our pins. So if I click on this pin, you see first thing why I verified. First, it's connected to my website. Second, it's connected to my profile. So you basically see my logo. On the below, the, you have the title, right? And you have the description. So here you see my profile, my business profile on Pinterest. You see my logo or your profile picture if you have it there. Then you see the name of the profile. And you can also see if you actually uh, go to different account. This is my different account for my blog about traveling and gastronomy. This I have for a lot of years, I think for maybe six, seven, eight years, this profile. But if I uh, click on this other profile, you and you are verified, you see again, this website has been claimed. I can, uh, you have the button to follow me, right? So you have three options. Like you have three, let's say how you, how you know if the website was claimed. If I go and see, any other, I'm searching for Christmas decor ideas on Pinterest, and you see already the difference between these pins. So if I go scroll a little bit down, and apart from being promoted, some of these are promoted pins, of course, but if I click, for example, on this pin, 50 plus cozy creative small apartment Christmas decor ideas, you don't see anything here, like you don't see the profile, you don't see the logo or profile picture, so it's clear this is not even, there is no business profile here. There is, yeah, you can only click here, discoverhubpages.com, which is probably not even website, or maybe it's, uh, they didn't have, they don't have their own domain. So if I click like here, let's see if I see anything. You see again? Yes, I can see. So this profile, it's uh, Michaela Diane Designs. I can see uh, her profile picture. I can also follow her if I want. And that means she has verified her business, her website, Michaela Design, Michaela, uh, Michaela Diane Designs.com. She verified her website, as you can see, with Pinterest. 
And that's why I also have the option to follow her. And that's why also I see her pins this way. So you can follow me straight away. I don't have to even click on the profile. And uh, it's also telling Pinterest, yes, you have this website, it's your domain, and you can use it for Pinterest, all your content and promote it there. So definitely, if you are new to Pinterest and you don't have website yet, you can always uh, start, okay, with Etsy or different platform. But in the long run, and Pinterest, yes, it's a long run game, uh, you want to have your own platform. Even if you're just selling, you want to maybe sell your products. So just create like a basic e-shop, e-shop store, e-commerce store, where you can buy your domain, uh, make it some uh, maybe like Shopify or some other platform you can use and basically then connect on Pinterest. Why? Because uh, again, it will in the long run and you might not see it straight away, but in the long run for sure, 100% based on my experience, uh, all the pins are going to have much better engagement and impressions and basically clicks and everything if you have verified website. And if your pins going back to your verified website, you see that all my pins from here are going to my shop because I'm promoting not only the gifts, I mean, not only the travel gear, but it's a different product pages. I can drive them to my blog. I can drive them to different pages about me, about the story. So you always want to have verified website. So let's see, follow me. If you like this video, follow me here subscribe you know the drill <laughs> subscribe for more videos about pinterest and how to monetize your business